hello everyone welcome to my channel my name is Ernesta if today is your first time you're welcome and if you've been part of this family I just want to say thank you for watching my videos and God will bless you if you have not subscribed what are you waiting for subscribe to this channel and belong to this uh, wonderful family I know you will not regret it apart from infertility now and then we'll bring in things that will help us and I know that it's not just going to help the, the people going for the journey but you yourself even good health is good for everyone so uh subscribe and, and and you know stop here and watch our videos and you'll not regret it and i want to thank everyone that made up this enesta for me i just want to say thank you i know for the past maybe five days or how many days few videos that i've made now i've been saying thank you thank you thank you i am so grateful i know that i didn't tell you guys about my 1k i'm gonna find a time to tell you properly and you know last week you guys took me to hit my 1k which i am grateful and the watch hour is going on and on and on and on as i am grateful for that as well god has brought you to kind of add to me and i will stop at nothing to kind of be used for you as well so we're going to be like helping each other and you know uh, educating each other and pushing each other you know to get the best out of life as well and that is why i am doing this today uh today i had some things this week that i want to pass across to you i don't want to enjoy things alone i want you to, to enjoy because we are family and i want us to kind of grow together this week i kind of got to to kind of try some things on oh, not just this week it's been going on and but i kind of see that is is good and it's real so i thought okay i'll bring it to you by the way i know i was supposed to go to part two and three of where uh, two three or four i don't know how far it's going to go off uh, how comforting the symmetry is i am not deviating from it i'm still going to complete that uh, topic but today i just thought this is the last weekend in the month of june so i need to kind of talk to my family you know how you talk and you take inventory at the end of the year or at the end of the month and you look at the year or the month and think oh what have i achieved and all those things so i just want us to have that kind of family talk today and uh, so that we can all if you don't do it before you can think of doing it that uh, you need to kind of take inventory of everything you do either yearly or monthly or however you want to do it just kind of that will help you to kind of set a goal and achieve it as well so that is what i am here to do today because this is the last weekend in the month of june i want us to kind of not just the month of june is the, is the last weekend in the in the sixth first month of the year so and i know with the covid thing of three months i know that we we, we kind of uh, lose three months of going about or doing things so that one is there and the other three months uh what you did with it and the next six months you're going in, going into what are you going to do with it or what you, you your plans are now so that you can think towards it and kind of make good use of the the, the next three months that will uh, six months that will make uh make up the year so that if you get double or triple or four times uh what you should uh, you know in that six months it will cover for the rest of the other six months so that is what this video is all about i kind of want to kind of uh, like me when we got into this year from january till march was a very 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 uh, uh it was a year i won't say a bad year it was a year that uh i and my family went through uh a really really a big thing that really you know put us down and by the time at the at the end of march that i was thinking of getting up to kind of pick myself and do something then the covid holiday came and then i'm stuck here for three months and that is like six months of this year would have been gone for you know like that without me uh, being able to say this is what i've achieved but by the grace of god and his mercies at least i was able to start this uh, uh youtube in my room here and this far that god has used you guys to get me everything so i'm kind of grateful to god that these six months i can pinpoint something that this is what i achieved in these six months if you are like me that that you know that you cannot really say this is what you have achieved or you feel the six months is gone without you having anything to to say i know with life we have life so that is another thing but i'm talking about like things like what you should have done that you didn't do or 
things that you you did that you did wrong and all those things those are the things i'm referring to because life i tell you the people that are gone they want one more day but they did not get it we are here so it is a big achievement so i'm talking about like things that you added to that life now is what i'm talking about so for me i can say okay with this youtube i i achieved this because this is like something that i've been you know wanting to do for years that i could not that these three months god just kind of pushed me through i am so grateful this is a very big achievement for me it's a great one for me and i'm grateful for it and i want us to know that this weekend if you have not sat down to tell yourself what you want to achieve in this year or what you want to achieve in the next six months that you want to put all your efforts into and ask god to kind of guide you through please do do you can still get what you didn't get in these six months you can still get it in in the next six months what you didn't get in these three months you can still get them in the next six months so please this weekend instead of going about you know partying or going about use it as a, a you know a time to kind of go to the lord in prayer if you're a christian or if you are if you believe whatever you believe go to that god in prayer but i believe in the living god so i will go to the living god and you know for prayer go to god in prayer and let god direct you let him tell you what you need to do to recover this this month that you we have lost and that is why i'm doing this video and i want to give a, a few things that you can think of i know sometimes we look at those things that are, they, they are so big and uh they're not they are impossible they are not impossible just try like i always say trying and failing you will never regret it but not trying at all you will regret it so please try some of these things if they don't work they don't work no one is going to catch you or hold you for, responsible for them and if they work for you all well and good you know branch out this time branch out branch out and try and try something new this time and for those who have business ideas already that are still thinking of it don't think about it jump into it when i mean jump into it be prepared and jump into it and don't wait till you have the whole wide world or the money the whole money before you do it you know you can there are some that you don't need money to do and there are some you need money to do and there are some all you need is time contacts and you know three of the money contact and time so you can start and these three things you cannot tell me you are lacking any of them if you don't have money you have time if you don't have time you have contact so those three things as long as you have one of them you can go into any business you want to do and i want you to look into um i'm going to give us few now and we will be talking now and then i'll be dropping uh, some that are possible to us i'm doing it this because for us for those that are going through infertility by the time you start having children, I don't think if you're like me, I don't think you want to you want to allow someone to come and mind your baby for you. You want to mind your baby because you know how you how far you went to get that baby. So you want to mind your baby and you want to be there for your baby. You want to be the one doing all the mother and uh, the school runs and everything. So you need something that will bring you money that you'll not be running around or saying you are keeping your child with someone and going to work for a whole day or going to work a whole night and all these things so that is why i'm bringing this thing and again the journey itself is so expensive so you need to plan ahead even if you are going now you need to plan ahead you know you need to and if you've done so much and you've lost everything this is another opportunity for you pick yourself up and start getting uh, getting involved in things and trust me god will butter your bread and i always say something i say the only person that can stop you is you no man out there can stop you but you if they like they should say anything that you're not good enough or you cannot do things and uh, do things well if you don't agree with them trust me you will do it well but if you agree with them then you will not do it well because i believe that two cannot work together i said they're in agreement they can say anything they can throw anything but you have to agree with it if you do not agree with it it will not stand it will not stand at all god has given us authority here on earth to take charge and to dominate 
he has said he has given us all here we can call him for help but he has given us and when we take a step he will back us up as long as the step is a good step he will back us up and as we go into this new month of uh, july which is the beginning of the the half of the year please 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 think of what you want to do start something if it is investment you want to go into go into it if it is property go into it whatever you need to go and trust me you don't need so much to invest if it is one thousand two thousand three thousand four thousand anything you have just invest and you see that yeah they will tell you the interest may be small or the the, the income may be small is better than keeping it and spending it or keep borrowing it to people and they keep it for three months four months one year and bring it with no interest is better and sometimes they don't even bring it anything can happen you will not see that money again so please try and invest even if it is 500 you have as a spare money put it somewhere if you leave it lying with you that is when you see one party cloth and you go and buy or you see one shoe in the shop or uh, one clothes and you think i need it but when they are when they are tied down you will not go and pull it because once you pull it out you are pulling it out at your own risk so try and do it and make sure you go for if it is like three months or four months or three months six months they have three months six months or nine months or one year fix one that you will not call it back. if you call it back you lose your interest if you like go for those long time one tie the money down in you know put it on something and you will see you will kind of at the end of that time that that the time you are putting on it you you see that you have money coming back and then you have more to add because you'll not be used to doing things that way and if it is property you want to go into i know people think going into property you have to have loads of money no you don't have to have loads of money three things you need when you want to go into property one either you go into property um you know with money to invest or you go into property with time to invest or you go into property with contact if you have money fine it will be easier for you to make more money but if you don't have money and you have contacts you can you can go to your contacts and find them customers and then you have a but make sure you do it properly otherwise they will they will they will kind of uh is it bypass or cut you off and do it without you knowing when you go into it properly and they do that you can get whatever belong to you back but if you don't do it properly they can just uh you know cut you off uh along the line before you bring the two of them the the, the things you the, the house you see and the buyer before you bring them together make sure you document it well that they whatever they do they must include you if they do it behind you they will still give you your your cut out of it because it's your business you brought it to them so make sure everything is done properly pay the price don't say oh i don't want to pay the lawyer to do this for me i don't want to pay to get this done at the end of the day you're going to lose everything so kind of make it and do it well you might have contacts that is another thing you may not be getting as much as having money to invest but it's better than nothing and you might have time if you have time you can go round you can check some on the internet you can go around properties you can go around uh, as well to check and get addresses and talk to the owners and everything and you can look for buyers as well there are some buyers that are buying for you know they are selling for cash and some are buying for cash those ones you get your own cut out of it when you bring them together you get a cut out of it as well so it's not like you go today you find it today it might be you might find it today if you know and you might it might take you some weeks or some time continue you will get there when you bring them together you will get something out of it by the time you do three four five you know you are coming and you are building your own money on how to start your own uh, you know property thing and as you are watching them you are learning as well what you should do so a lot of things you can do now that you are not tied down with any babies yet or tied down with anything yet maybe probably you have time i know you'll be working even even if it is weekend or take a day and try and introduce this thing into your system you'll see you'll be able to because by the time the babies are here you're not going to be this work you're not going to want to be doing it that way so you need something solid that can bring in um you know money to you to you and on a lo long run is going to pay you more so today i thought i'd bring it to you guys so that you can branch out and you can do something else you can think of something else investment too is good if, if it's 300 500 600 1000 
2000 you are put it somewhere it might be little interest but the thing you are getting from there is that you are learning to invest you are kind of training yourself that investment is good investment is good that is what you are training yourself and try and and make sure that you don't spend all your earning they should be part of your earning that you spend and they should be part that goes into investment or go into savings for no matter what it is you're not going to go and take it so please put all these things into consideration as you are going on this journey and start doing something for yourself as well that will help you i don't think i want to have kids and still be running around and going to work and putting my baby to stay with someone else i don't think that is one of the plans i don't think that plan is is for me and i don't know about you i i believe that you you will only do it if you don't have a choice but now you have a choice to think wide so please guys try and do what will make life easy for you i thought i'd bring it to you guys and i'm gonna go back to my video maybe the next one that is coming will be the, a continuation of the one i've done before but this one i want you to use this weekend to kind of think of what you want to do next with your life because we are going into this july now put it to use and get double from these six months for the six months we've already you know lost or lose the six months we lose we've lost so get double or triple from this half of the year to cover all for the the half of the year that is gone and you will see things will work out this 2020 let it be a year of abundance for us despite despite everything that has happened we should still come out smiling and being grateful to the god we serve that i serve i'll be grateful to him so i'm gonna love and leave you here i will not um go on from here because this video is going so, so 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 fast so let's cut it here and god bless you see you in my next video please watch my videos to the end and if you've not subscribed please subscribe and thumbs up for me as well god bless you bye